Hey guys, what's going on? It's me Nathan. Just want to say uh, good afternoon, good evening to everyone, both the East and West Coast. If you guys are enjoying your day, say here on Sunday, if you guys are also enjoying your weekend. And for this video today, I want to tell you guys about this. Predictions for WB Night of Champions 2015, which is tonight uh, here live on pay-per-view and on the WB Network for the 20th of September 2015, which is today here on Sunday. So, let's go into it. The link will be in the description below. So this is from wikipedia.com slash wiki um, slash uh, Night of Champions 2015. And uh, let's get right into it for the predictions. So for the first match, this is the kickoff uh, match for the show. Neville and Luke, the Ultra uh, Dragons, Castillo and Sin Cara, taking on the Cosmic Wastelands, uh, Stardust and the Ascension, Connor and Victor. In a six-man tag team match. Now, um... I do see the cause of Wastelands winning this match um, because, you know, uh, Stardust and, uh, you know, Way Bear lost. So, you know, Stardust and his team need to win this match to get momentum. So, I see them winning this match too. But if not, I, I will not be surprised if Neville, if Neville and the Lucha Dragons do win the match. Next match is uh, for the main card. The New Day, uh, Cody Kingston, Biggie, and or Xavier Woods taking on the Dudley Boys, Bell Ray Dudley and Devon Dudley. Um, as much as, as it would be uh, good to see, um, you know, the, the Dudley Boys win the tag team championships, I think that tonight is, is not the night. Unfortunately, I do see the New Day winning this match, uh, but not cleanly. So I do think that moving forward, uh, we will get the third guy for the Dudley Boys, and that has to be either Spike Dudley or it's someone else different for the Dudley Boys. Maybe say Tommy Dreamer. Uh, but I do see the New Day winning this match and retaining their tag team championships. Next match on the card, we have Dolph Ziggler versus Rusev with Summer Rae. A singles match, no titles online. Um, I I mean, I think it's fair that for Rusev to win this match. Because last month at SummerSlam, he should have won. And it should not have been a countout. Um, so I do see Rusev winning this match. Also, with Lana out, I think Summer Rae will provide the distraction for Rusev to win. Next match we have is the Wyatt family of Bray Wyatt, Luke Harper, Braun Strowman taking on Roman Reigns, Dean Ambrose, and a partner to be announced. And, you know, to me, we're, we've been hearing rumors that The Rock, Chris Jericho, Samoa Joe, and others are could be uh, Roman Reigns and Dean Ambrose tag team partner. But I kind of wonder what if it's someone that we haven't really heard about. If it's going to be The Rock, I'll, I won't, will not be, you know, disappointed or signing at that. I'll be happy. And, uh, I mean, same thing goes for Chris Jericho. Uh, but I think out of all of them, I think the partner could be The Rock. If not him, then probably Samoa Joe. But whoever it is, uh, I, th I see Roman Reigns, Dean Ambrose, and their partner losing this match to the Wyatt family. Because, look, they need to have, to actually get a win here and become strong and get the win, basically. Next match we have is Nikki Bella, the D Divas Champion, go up against Charlotte for the WWE Divas Championship, Divas Championship in a singles match. If Nikki gets counted out or disqualified, Charlotte will win the championship. And to me, Charlotte is going to win this match. Actually, she has to win because we all know on Monday Night Raw, which was the season, the season premiere of uh, the show, Nikki Bella retained, I think, because of the twin magic or whatever you want to call it. Um, but I do see uh, Nikki, Bell Nikki Bella losing this match. I think it's going to be clean or maybe dirty, but Sean is going to to win this match. Um, let's see here. Sean is going to win this match, uh, so she has to win. And um, so next match we have, let's see. We have the Intercontinental Championship on the line. We have right back the champion going up against Kevin Owens. I do see, um, I think Ryback's going to retain the championship uh, because um, I think it's too soon to actually for Kevin Owens to actually get a win here. Though maybe, you know, uh, Kevin, uh, Kevin Owens would probably win by maybe count out or something like that. Though Ryback will still retain. Though I do expect to see Ryback win this match and retain the Aircondo Championship. Next match we have on the card. This is the first match of the co-main event. It's the first match. Uh, John Cena taking on the United States Champion Seth Rollins. In the first match of Seth Rollins, the first, uh, first uh, one or two matches of Seth Rollins we could be in. And I see him actually losing this match to John Cena because, you know, it's clear to me that Cena's going to win the United States Championship back from Cena. I thought it was kind of ridiculous to actually have... Um, 
you know, Seth win the win, you know, just both uh, belts last time though. It, that match or some stuff should be just for the World Heavy Championship. Having it be for both United Championship and World Heavy Championship kind of makes some sense that Seth really doesn't defend it that much. So I see John Cena getting the win. And then we have the main event. We have the World Heavy Champion, Seth Rollins, taking on the icon, the main event player, the franchise player, Sting. Um, this is a this is a hard one for me. Because I know as much as everyone would like to see Sting win the WWE World Heavy Championship, actually get his, you know, um, win here, become the champion, and winning every champ major, major championship in every organization. You know, at the same time, you know, Seth Rollins, you know, as much as people may not like his reign, he has been, you know, the guy that's leading the charge. And I wouldn't... Sorry about that. I would not be surprised, actually, if Seth Rollins does win or... Or... If Sheamus actually cashes it in, now is the cashing going to be successful or is the cashing going to actually fail? Um, I think that the cash in, it may, I think it's going to go both ways, but I see a lot of, sh of uh, shenanigans going on in this matchup. So, um, I'm for this match, I'm going to go with a toss up, it can go either way. But, um, yeah, so my predictions are the first match, New Day taking on the Dudley Boys for the 10 championships. I see uh, the New Day retaining. Uh, Dolph Ziggler is Rusev with Summer Rae. Rusev will win. Uh, Roman Reigns, Dean Ambrose, and, and their partner to be announced, taking on the Wyatt family. The Wyatt family will win, despite whoever their partner uh, will be for Roman Reigns and Dean Ambrose. Nikki Bella, the Divas champion, going against Charlotte. It is Charlotte getting the victory. Uh, right back, the Intercontinental Champion going, uh, going up against Kevin Owens. Uh, right back will retain. Seth Rollins, Champion going up against John Cena for the United States Championship. Uh, I do see John Cena winning that match. And Seth Rollins, the Royal Champion, going up against Sting for, uh, Sting for the Royal Championship. This is, it's going to be a toss up. So, um, anyway, guys, tell me in the console what you think about this. Do you like it? Do you not like it? Are you middle neutral about the predictions I made for Night Champions 2015? And if so, tell me in the yes comments down below. Don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to always subscribe to my channel, guys. And I'll check the time. It's Nate saying peace, take care. I'll see you guys later. It's video coming up later on today afternoon. Tonight, tomorrow, or in a couple of minutes. So stay tuned. So until next time, take care, guys. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Uh, enjoy the rest of your Sunday. And uh, stay, from, stay tuned for more content to come on my channel very soon. Take care, guys. Peace. And have a good Sunday. Bye.